Hopefully you guys stay there. It's Sunday. Um, I chatted with my hairdresser yesterday on Facebook. I'm supposed to call her on Tuesday. That's when she'll be back in the shop. To get an appointment to get... cha -ca! Yeah. Um, some things came in the mail. They came yesterday, but the mail was not checked till today. So some things I thought were not here were really here. Uh, first off, you can't really see these that well, but a friend Ken made some. He's from Pennsylvania. I got the rest of them in here, but they're things he made on his Cricut. You can't tell. Okay, oh, maybe you can. In loving memory of Tula Crow, and then the, her birth date and her death date. And um, these two are going to my Aunt Donna and Uncle Jeff. Because my Uncle Jeff's coming into town tonight, and he'll be at her tomorrow. And um, he wanted to come alone. Aunt Donna's like, he, I was going to come with him, but he wanted to come alone. I think he just, he's pro still processing it, so I can understand that. Uh, here is the business card for him. He does, uh, I think he does cups too and stickers and things like that. And then I got some more cards. Two are exactly the same. I got this one. Pow, pow. It's such a peaceful and serene card. And this is from Carol Ann. And I, there's a note in here which I will read after. Um, thank you so much. Where are you from? You are from Tennessee? Does that say Tennessee? Or Indiana? I can't tell. Uh, it could be an I or it could be a T. It's one of those two. One of those two. So I gotta set this here to read when I'm done. This one, Twinsy, pa pow, is from my friend Shannon. She's the one that we have the flowers on our kitchen table, and they're still holding up pretty well. I'll show you when I go in there. I'm going to show you our new TV stand, which if you're on my Facebook, you saw. T tomorrow night is going to be, uh, tomorrow afternoon is going to be putting together uh, a thing for the kitchen, and I ordered another thing for the kitchen. Um, so yeah, there's this one. And this is from, oh. Angela, I need to get a hold of her too. Hi! Yes, we do need to get together and have dinner and meet your man. I haven't seen her in forever. Uh, I'm going to put that one aside too. Got a whole stack of cards and stuff up there from the other day. And I just got done doing work because tomorrow morning Dad's taking his car to the shop to get an oil change. And then I got to get up and take a shower. We got to roll out go uh, to Meyer. They have cherries on sale for $1.49 a pound, so I'll be getting me some cherries. This week they got watermelons for $1.99, limit two. I'll be getting two of those, one for me and one for my friend. I text him like, uh, do you want watermelon? And I think Dad might get a few snacky things. Like I said, he's going on a road trip. I might have mentioned that yesterday or day before, whenever. He's leaving tomorrow about 12, 12.30 and won't be back until Tuesday some time. Say thank you up, go probably afternoon sometime. So I know he wants to take some cherries with him and he might get some radishes as snacks and he's gonna take a little cooler with some waters and stuff in it. So not a huge shopping trip, just a couple little things. I wanna get some potatoes because they're on sale. I'm gonna go peel the last three of ours. I'm gonna fry those later. With hot dogs. We're having hot dogs today. Okay. Let's go to the living room. I'll show you our new um, TV thing. Hang on. Okay. There's Kitty's toy. She was flopping that thing all around last night. Um, that's our new TV stand. This is our old one that we need to get rid of. But um, this thing is heavy duty too, man. I got, I got It's got drawers, which is nice. Two little cabinets. I think I might put Heidi's box ashes in there somewhere on the one of those shelves but um we like it it came out nice i mean this here's a good good camera too it's a solder solder brand and it's you open this up and there's a lock compartment with the key in it where you lock you can lock stuff back in there like 
private things, I guess. I've never used it. Never used that function. I just left the key sitting in the lock. So yeah, that's our old one. Someone is like on top of me like I'm a mountain. Yeah. Oh, extreme close up. Okay, turn around and get settled. I'm laying on my side. She likes to, there, nope, nope, bunny. okay. You wanna be pet some more. Her feet feel like knives. I swear, I swear they do. They have little tiny daggers that come out of them. Come on, get settled. Jeez, oh, Pete's kitty. Get settled. Come on, settle. Lay down. Lay down. Mrs. Lay down. Okay, there. She's getting settled. Ah, much better. She's gonna need my side. This is our evening routine. Happy Monday! We are heading to the grocery store. We're going to Meyer to get a few supplies. And that's our, just our outing. That's not gonna be very long. It's now about 10.15. Dad hits the road in a couple hours. We just, Della running in town and went to the bank, went to the post office and mailed some stuff. And we dropped our absentee ballots off at our township hall. Um, and now we're stopping to get my scooter. And uh, roll it out. Maybe I'll film in the store, we'll see. I'm in here waiting for Dad. I already checked out. Mainly, I just bought produce and an iTunes card, but I've lost him. He went to go get beer because they have it on sale, and I haven't seen him since. So I'm just parked up front waiting. See, in the wire. Busier today than I thought it would be. A lot of people buying watermelons because they're dollar ninety nine. Limit two. A lot of people buying. We found some. Well, I'll show you what he bought. We got some ground beef uh, at a really nice price. We got a bunch to put in the freezer, but all right. Let's see how long it takes him to come out. Just got back from Meyer. It was pretty much all produce. I got some lettuce, two things of cherries. I had them $1.49 a pound, so I'm gonna be eating some cherries. Radishes, a pepper, some grape tomatoes, turnips. And they had these on sale. It was actually a limit of two. Dad got two, I got two, and I might have actually gone in and got two more. I mean, it was a really good sale. I'm gonna get ready to put these in the freezer. So, yeah. Bye! Dad's leaving on his road trip. Now I gotta put all this crap away. I gotta clean these. I gotta clean some celery that's over there. and Hopefully Jimmy my refrigerator around and get it all in there. Someone's peeking at me. Hi, Kitty. Hi, Kitty, what are you doing? Are you watching? Huh, you watching me? Okay, I just got all the hamburger ready for the freezer. Two of them I'm gonna freeze whole. I sucked all the air out of the bags as much as I could. Um, in case I wanna do like a big batch of taco meat or hamburgers on the grill. And then these, the rest of them I cut in half. I did put one in the, freeze, in the fridge to see if a friend wants it. So now I'm gonna stack these all in the freezer. When dad comes home tomorrow, we'll put them out in our other freezer. But for now, I'm just gonna stick them here in the house. Okay, wait for my friend to come over to, uh, there's going to be a shelf go right between that window and the wall. So, that's the next project. I just turned the fan on, blowing in here, because the only AC in the house is, like I said, in my bedroom. Eventually we're going to get that one hooked up at that end of the living room, but we haven't yet. So, we'll see what it looks like when the new shelf goes together in here. Thought I saw him, but I didn't. Okay, bye. I'm very excited because I ordered Indian food and we're coming to pick it up. I've never ordered to go here ever, but desperate times. It just, I've been wanting it for so long. And I told my friend, I'm like, we're going to get Indian food. I'll have to show you all the furniture too. I got all the furniture in the house that's gonna come in uh, so far. And um, so yeah, but now I'm waiting for our food to come out. We have to smell it for 20 minutes going home. Ugh. I haven't ate anything today because I was saving myself for Indian food and it's like five o'clock at night. That's a lie, I had a nutty bar earlier so I wouldn't get a headache and a bottle of water. But okay, Indian food. This is our Indian, our own personal Indian buffet. We have 
tandoori chicken. That's naan bread. We have some samosas and what are them things called? Put, 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 something. Then a random, I got a two things that are just a variety of stuff. Got some chicken tikka masala, rice, this is mango pudding, these balls. So yeah, now we're going to figure out what everything is because we are clueless. Okay, in an Indian food coma, my friend just left. Here is the one piece that we put together. This is my toaster oven and I will be putting it in the microwave right here and I'll get plugged in right down here and I'll still have space over here to like stir stuff or whatever. Um, and then over here, this is a piece I bought at a furniture store. It was all together um, oh, quite a while ago that we just stored. It's going to be like, they're going to be like a chip basket and this stuff like that. And a, a drawer for dad to put his wallet, keys and stuff in. And then back here, this piece came today. This is a little Heidi Way rolly cart to put extra storage on. Um, I just ordered that a couple days ago and I got here today. So that will be right back here in the corner. And next to the fridge. So it'll be that compartment, that, the fridge. And that's wedged between the fridge and the stove. And I like this right up against the stove so food can't fall down in there. So that is our setup as of right now. I think someone likes that we have carpet again. <laughs> it's kind of dark in here. I just got my, I got chips, candies, oatmeal, and my emergency, and crackers. And I put a couple bigger things over here on this shelf. And I'm gonna, I'm probably gonna set my instant pot here eventually. Um, are you just having a grand old time when they're rolling around, huh? Uh oh, here she comes because I'm talking to her. What? What? <laughs> All right. Look who I caught in the front window. Do you like that? See, you got a big ledge to sit on. This is the first time I've seen her do this. Dad said he saw her do it the other day. It's taken her this long to get brave enough to sit in the front window. I'm so happy you like it. I wish it was nice enough to have the window open, but it's too hot. Can't do that, kitty. Wait till you see Sammy outside the window one day. I'm sure you're going to like seeing him. Okay. That's my... She was sitting here looking at him like, oh, maybe she'll jump up there. Maybe. She, this is where I want to put a cat tree, right there. So it might work out well. But all right, I'm going to get all my clips together, and I'll see you guys later. Kitty, say goodbye. Hey. Oh, yeah, oh, bye-bye. She's getting down. <laughs> and she's off. There's my shoes, my favorite shoes. Okay, bye.